end just like that. We're back again. Uncle Bokow in the freaking building. Guys, it's a beautiful rainy day here in Central North Carolina. And um, we're going to do a pepper review and we're going to talk about pepper pairing. So what I have here is a absolutely stunning boot jaloki of mustard, okay? Now, I don't want you to get confused. There's actually two mustard boots out there. This is the milder one, way milder. There's another one that came from the Christopher Phillips line. It's also called the khaki boot. Stupid hot. It'll give you the worst throat burn you ever had. This is not that. This is a regular mustard boot. Let's cut it open and see what it looked like. Yes. Oh, it smells hot as all heck. Yeah. That's the interior. And, and uh, I'm going to show you guys how I um, snack on pepper. So I have here, this is amazing. You can take a screenshot of that. This is a Parmesan Gouda Aichens. It's uh, from Hidden Acres. And it is the absolute best cheese I've ever had. It's very sharp, smooth. I don't know how to explain it, but it's sharp. And it's really, really good. I have some summer sausage, some cheese, and then I'm gonna put this, put that placenta right there on top of it. <clears throat> okay, it's hot. Super tasty. Mustard pods, you can use them in many different things with many different foods but I'll give you a bonus yeah that's Uncle Bull Cow's Vicious Verde a Verde sauce with fresh mustard pods I like Verde with chocolate and mustard pods I don't know why oh that's hot I usually forget to put a link in the description but you guys if I don't you can go to Uncle Bull Cow Square. So like, just go to Google, put Uncle Bull Cow hot sauce, and get you some of this. Heat centric. This is his favorite sauce for steak. KTB sauce. He went nuts over this. Um, she did. She went absolutely bonkers over that sauce. All right. So now we're gonna kick it up even another notch. It puts the verde sauce on the cheese. It does this when it's told. Puts the pepper on top. <clears throat> if you don't have a verde sauce and you have some like pickled jalapenos, try it. I don't know what it is, but hot sauce and pods together on food, they they kick it up a notch. They bring that culinary umami to another level. Wow. That's phenomenal. I am sorry, but that is just top notch. My burn is, is pretty intense right now. But because I'm eating it with some cheese, it's not as bad as if I was to eat the pod by itself. But like I've said before, I don't I don't like pods by themselves. I mean, I don't bite into raw zucchini or squash by itself. You know, a cucumber, I don't just bite into it. I eat it with a salad. I chop these up, put them in a salad. You know. But I have eaten whole pods before. Don't get me wrong. If I'm coming home from work and I see a nice ripe scotch bonnet sitting there just staring at me, sometimes I'll just grab it off the plant and bite into it. Scotch bonnets are one of the few peppers that I'll do that with. Carboneros, yeah, there's a few. Most of the super hot, most of the milder stuff, jalapenos. I don't want to just eat them whole. I don't like it. Um, but I like them with food on a sandwich chopped up, throw them on some spaghetti, whatever the case may be. Mm, mm, mm. That is so good. Uh, you guys are going to see me review a whole bunch of peppers. There's a lot more. I 
in the next uh, two weeks. So stay tuned. You're going to probably see Pepper reviews pretty much every day. Why? It's pod season, y'all. We just came out of sauce season. Sauce season is where hot sauce, you know, you go outside and you look up in the trees, you just pick a bottle of hot sauce. It, it grows naturally. But, yeah, I love both, man. I like pod season better, though, because I can have pods and hot sauce. Tell that pod was a little bit underripe, but it was fully mature. If it wasn't, it wouldn't be burning me at all. Hands down, slamming, man. If you guys have never tried this, this is my favorite, though. Mad Mash. I also have Blazing Bonnet, my Scotch Bonnet hot sauce. And they all got good heat to them. But yeah, wow, Hidden Acres, shout out to Hidden Acres. You guys look this up, take a screenshot. Look them up, get your hands on this cheese. They have another one, it's a, I don't know, a German name or something. It's so, it's, it's, I can't remember the name of it. That cheese is phenomenal also. Now I am gonna save the rest of this because, why? Today, Uncle Bokau is making homemade pizza dough and calzones uh, for my family. The girls go nuts over them. Uh, it's one of their favorite foods. And so once a week, I make them calzones. I got some organic ricotta cheese, uh, some pecorino romano, and some uh, uh, parmigiano reggiano. I'll put some of this on the bottom layer, then the ricotta, and the other cheeses, and it will be phenomenal. And I have some, uh, you know, I've got canned tomatoes, I'll make a sauce and put on top. I got some Primatali flake, the Primatali flake just kicks it up. So my burn is now more of a stinging tongue burn. Um, you don't get much of a throat burn when you're uh, eating pods with food. Uh, by themselves, yeah, throat burn is pretty intense, but... That is an excellent pepper. Guys, stay tuned. I'm gonna be reviewing some scorchers, some stupid hot peppers over the next week, maybe two weeks. And then after that, two weeks, we got a surprise for you. We're gonna have all kinds of really, really cool content. You guys are gonna love it. If you haven't done so already, join the bullpen. That's exclusive content. Um, I'm making extra content for members, okay? I'm not taking anything away from you guys. All the stuff that I do normally is going to be on here, and you're going to see tons of content on here. But the bullpen is extra. There's more personal stuff that I won't, won't put publicly. Um, uh, there's stuff that you, know, you can't say publicly. There's also going to be some behind the scenes, some extra stuff, some early releases, you know, custom emojis and all that stuff. Um, and some kind of exclusive when something new is coming out, you know, or maybe a, a sale or something that myself or somebody else is doing, I'll break it to. But it, it's it's definitely, um, it's a good time. And uh, yeah, if you guys want to join, just go to my channel or scroll down. You should see something down there. Maybe uh, I'll put it in the comments. Join the bullpen. Jump on board. It's going to be a heck of a ride. Uncle Bokal loves you. What?